Good morning. Another beautiful day. Another beautiful time to be present. All right, now let's check the time. <sighs> mm, nice. Waking up early every day now. Wait. Well, uh, hold on. End up being president of the clock. What? Uh, uh, my, uh, my shift of being president again now. It's only been like four years since I've been pre. Wait, what? Wait, four years. What? Oh, uh, hold on. Uh, enter. What you need, sir? What? What? What year is it? Um, it, it's 2020. Don't you remember that whole ball drop thing that you did? That, that whole party that you had last night? What? Uh, oh, yeah, forgot about that. Um, uh, d does this mean I, I can't be president anymore since, well, I mean, I was elected in 2016 and, and now it's 2020 and being president usually lasts like four years? Uh, well, I suppose that's true, boss. I guess it's time that you have to end being president. <sighs> I knew that this day would come. All right, time to time to spread the word. All right, got my piece of paper and got my pencil. Now it's time to get writing. Citizens of poor city. Sincerely, minimum wage. All right. The letter is done. Now all I have to do is make about a hundred copies of this thing and spread them all over the city. This is gonna be a long day. <sighs> what a wonderful year just being out in the park. Wait, and now that I think about it, why am I out in the park on such a windy day? Shouldn't I be here when it's like sunny or something? Eh, whatever. I, I guess I, I, I guess I, sometimes I could just enjoy the cold. There is absolutely nothing that can ruin my day. What the, what is that? What is, what is this? Hmm. Citizens of Plush City. My time of being president has officially come to an end. If you want to volunteer to replace my role as president, which comes with free food and huge responsibility, then head over to Polyester Plaza and sign in for the 2020 election. Make sure to come prepared tomorrow with a complete speech and good reasoning. Sincerely, minimum wage. Guys, I think we just found the perfect opportunity to help out the world. Um, what are you talking about, Brownlock? What? Don't you see? Wade is no longer president, and he's giving us an opportunity to be his replacements. So therefore, we can expand our alliance as making us the new president of Plush City and remaking the world to be our own. Uh, Bradlock, you do realize you can't have more than one president. Who said that you were going to be president, Gleno? I am clearly going to be head president of Flush City, considering I am the leader of this trio. Well, I guess that makes sense. So, what do you say, guys? Shouldn't we prepare for our new speech for Plush City? Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, let's do that. Let's go. Well, that took a lot of time. Well, I guess now it's just resting and just waiting for tomorrow for the election to start. Come on. Kill every president! Kill every president! Kill every president! Come back tomorrow for the election. I'm trying to I'm trying to rest. Come on, Rose! You gotta let me be president! You read the whole thing. Read it again. Fine. My time of being president. No. The last sentence. Sincerely minimum wage. No. The one before that. 
Make sure to come prepared tomorrow with a complete speech and reasoning. I got a speech and good reasoning! Tomorrow? Oh! Okay, I get it. Sorry for, sorry for bugging in. Yeah, and thank you for busting my door. I just got that thing! Alright, now time for me to rest. Thank you, sir. Now, if you would kindly sign this paper, you can go and run for president. <laughs> okay, then. Uh, is the coast clear now? Yeah. Alright, good. <sighs> Alright, miss. All you have to do to run for president is just sign this paper and write your name on it. Okay. Thank you. Okay, done. Thank you, miss. You can you can go through the door. Thank you. All right. Well, that's two down and a bunch more to go. Well, here comes the election. The day that I stop being president. I'm going to miss this old place. Well, might as well find out who is going to take my spot. <sighs> Hello? Hey, Lucky Bat. Um, could you give me the TV remote? Wait, I'm over at the election center. I can't go all the way back here. You're gonna have to get it yourself. <sighs> ah, darn. Well, I, I guess, I guess Lucky Bat's right. I guess I do have to get the remote myself. But it's so far away. Come, come on, my stupid remote. Get over here. Stupid, stupid remote. Come on. I guess I got the remote. Finally, now I can watch the election myself. Hello, boys. We are here at the Polyester Plaza at the new 2020 Election Center. We have a very large crowd with us today. A very large crowd. I was expecting this crowd to be much smaller considering that most people would be watching this in their TVs. But now that I think about it, this is probably the largest crowd we've ever had in history. I don't think everyone is watching this on their TVs right now. Cameras, sh shut the cameras off. How about we go to the audience? What? What? They're not doing it live? Oh man, now I'm never not gonna know who's the next president. I guess I'll just rest here not knowing who's gonna replace me. Just had to ruin the fun, didn't you? Sir Aspa, please tell me, how do you feel about this new election? Well, honestly, Comquad, it's... It's really something I wouldn't really have expected in this city. Maybe it's just because I'm just so used to having wages as our president with all of this luxurious stuff happening. I guess it's just it's just really hard for me to adjust to new changes. I don't know. Maybe I'm just upset that Wage isn't a candidate for this new presidency election. But I don't know. I guess I can get used to it. She's pretty nice. Actually really interested to see what happens. But let's just hope that nobody elects someone stupid. Oh, um, uh, 
A tray, is it called? Oh, uh, yes, Mrs. Kasugi, uh, what is it? I seem to notice that your kids... Where are your kids? And even if they're at home, who's babysitting them? Oh, uh, let's just say that they're teaching themselves a lesson. Kids, I think we learned a very important lesson today. Dang! A new election! Isn't this exciting, Chuck and Yucca? Yeah, of, of course it is, Ugly Charlie. You know, maybe we can have this be a little subject to one of our new movies. Oh, really? Oh, well, wouldn't that be exciting? <laughs> hey! Is that a Kira? Huh? Uh-oh, we've been caught! Ugly Charlie, run! No! Give me back my camera! Can't wait to see how it goes. <laughs> hey! Why don't you watch where we're going? No! <sighs> Whatever. <sighs> Hello, citizens of Plush City. Welcome to the 2020 election. As you know, you probably know how elections work. We have a bunch of candidates, and you guys will vote between all of those candidates to see who will become America's next president. Also, to clarify to all the little kids, you need to be an adult to actually vote. Anyways, let's let this election begin! Babo, who would you like to have for president? Well, Bertie, personally, I want the Wiki to be president! Um, Babo, I'm, I'm right here. Oh. Well, you're running for president, aren't you? Babo, if I'm running for president, then why am I in the audience group? If I was running for president, I would be- I would be under those covers. <laughs> Alright, Q candidate number one. Hey everyone, my name is Maxie, and I am volunteering for president. Now, if I'm president, I want to make sure that everyone has a good time for everybody. Um, any changes that you want to make? Well, thanks, Lucky Bad. I was just about to get into that. I also want to make sure that Pico gets everything that she wants. Yeah, so do that. Vote for us so you guys you can get stuff from me. What? Come on, dude! That's unfair! If anything, I should be the one who's getting all the treasures. Well, honestly, I like this new thing. Go, Pico, go, Pico, go, Pico! Anything else you want to say? Uh, no. Thank you. Let's go. No. 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 Well, isn't this gonna take a long time? You know what? To save time and not have this video be thirty minutes long, how about we do a small montage of all the candidates doing their thing, shall we? I want to make sure that everybody has the best time of their lives and gets all the support that they need, whether it be emotional help physical help, or mental help. Or making reservations to city buildings. We didn't agree to that. Uh, yes we did. I want everybody to have higher raises. Black people will receive a raise of 5%. And white people will receive a raise of 1,000%. Nope, 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 no, 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 get you out of here. No, why are you doing to me? I'm trying to make the world a better place. Yeah, but we don't need racism anymore. This isn't the 19th. I will put cameras all over the city, all over your houses to make sure that you guys are doing fine. And that's it. Just security cameras. Um, I will give you free food if you vote for me. And if I win to be president, I will make sure that everybody has the happiest lives ever. Whoa, 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 hold on, um, uh, miss? Yes? Exactly how old are you? Uh, 19? Why? Oh, uh, I'm sorry, miss, but you have to be 35 or older to actually, you know, try to run for president. Come on, come with me. No! Please, guys, vote for me, vote for me! The main thing I've been doing for president is that everybody will have to eat at Cinecrow Spicy Square for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, no matter what plans that they have for the future. 
Uh, how about no? Anyone who rebels against Suicess needs to be put under a rest of the bell. Um, security? <laughs> alright, alright, Lucky Bat, what do you need? We have an insane Yoshi on the spot here. Alright, come with me. No! No, you can't! That was the one! You all have to do it! I am here to run for president because... Could someone, could someone take this to the doctors, please? Come on, Dave. You're coming with me. Uh, everyone, uh, don't, don't worry about him. All right, all right. Hope, let's hope that this last candidate can act at least interest us a little bit. Come out, candidate number nine. Hello, fellow citizens of Plush City. I am here to run for president, and I will blow all of your minds with one simple thing. Boom. Wait, guys, why aren't you cheering for him? This is a good president. Fine. Guess you guys don't like me. Well, we'll just see about that once we get to the voting results. <sighs> but, hold on a second. I said that I've been president for four years. Can I still elect myself as president again? Oh, heck yes! Whew, yes! All my dreams have finally come back to me! Now I can finally stop any election or any people from being elected in their stupid little minds. Well, isn't this just a sucky election? <gasps> I'm here, Lucky Bat! And I'm here to all my fans! Oh, thank you, Wage. This, this election was, was really bad. All the all the all the candidates were like they had little to no reasoning whatsoever, and even to those who did have reasoning or felt like I had the opportunity to have reasoning, they ended up like getting injured or out of the competition. Well, now that you say that, Lucky Bat, I think that the only person who can do take this job is me. I think I'm really one of the only people who has the most reasoning and most dedication. To, well, manage something like this. So, what do you say, guys? Having me as president again? <laughs> Whew, thank goodness. That takes a load off my mind. Hold on, Lucky Bat, you're still my intern again. Dang it!